G'day guys, welcome to today's video. I tried it, I tried sleeping in but it just didn't happen. Got up at 5.30, it's nearly 6.30. Uh, gotta pack up all this stuff and get out of here. Uh, and we'll head out to Townsville for today. It's about 87, 88 k, something like that. I'm getting out of here. I'll tell you what though, sleeping on the bed I think stuff me up because I'm not used to it and my body just, just must have got soft from it and now I've woken up really sore when I sleep like on the hard ground and stuff your body just adapts it's crazy what the human body can adapt to for example laying on the hard ground and things like that like your body after a certain amount of time just gets used to it now I need to get used to sleeping on a comfy bed and my body's gotten soft now and I, I feel sore everywhere <laughs> anyway So I just made it back over to the same park I was at yesterday where the library is here. It's a really good park because I have the Wi-Fi password and everything so I'm just going to watch some videos and do a few things over some breakfast. I'm currently boiling some water at the moment. We're doing the, the water like that and we're going to have coffee first to wake us up. Vegemite Sangers and also oats are in there as well. So we're set for this morning. Oh, about 50 days, something like that. Fuck. <laughs> yeah. You have to stop for quite a bit of, uh, bit of water, would you? Yeah, some spots are pretty fast stretches and stuff. You've got to make sure you carry enough and all that. So. Sure, didn't see any wild pigs along the way? Oh, a few dead ones actually, eh? Yeah, yeah. only up and down this coastline. Yeah, yeah. Are yeah. 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 you originally from Melbourne or? Oh, not quite the city. I'm also like about 80 k's east in the Country Vic sort of area. A small town called Bunyip. Most people have never heard of it, so I don't really say the bunny. <laughs> I think I've only right. heard of it once, but I don't yeah. know on a fishing show. But oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Gippsland area is, is where it is oh, around yeah? there. Yeah, yeah. 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 Well, did you cut around or you just went straight through? Yeah, cut around, so I pretty much did the coast all the way around. Jeez. Yeah. Bit of riding. Yeah, she is, yeah. <laughs> just pull up and camp on the side of the road. Yeah, just got my tent here. Last night I actually stayed in the hotel, but or the pub there. Um, but yeah, every other night it's just set up a tent and just sort of hide away wherever I can kind of thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Just chill around here for a bit. Just be patient riding along there. Yeah. Yeah. Jeez. I know Townsville by bike, you would at least, probably at least take about, uh, I'd say probably about a whole day just to get up to Townsville. Mm. Yeah, that's where I was planning to, to get to today. Yeah. It's Townsville. Townsville will probably take at least about a whole day. Yeah. Yeah. Because I know that um, when I travel up by car, I have seen some people riding up to Townsville. Yeah. And um, as I'm coming back, they're just entering. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. yeah. So when I'm finished doing my stuff in Townsville, I've seen just. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's about 80, almost 90k or something yeah. like that. Yeah. 88k, I think it is. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. It was the worst actually because um, there was a bit of a headwind coming up this way. Yeah, at the moment the wind is going all that way. Yeah. It's yeah, it's good. <laughs> yeah, no. Oh, you got a map there or not? Mm. We are back on the road heading for Townsville. 88 k's from air and we've already done about five or so. I bumped into the two blokes at, at the Home Hill rest area who were cleaning and doing that. I met up with them just at that other rest stop back there that I just stopped at just quickly. Um, yeah, same blokes. They must do the cleaning and everything for like all the rest stops along this sort of shire and everything. Yeah, not to be mistaken to that other bloke that I was talking to at the park. Yeah, he was quite amazed. It was interesting. He was quite amazed by the whole journey and everything, which I'm sure most people are that I've talked to. So just taking a bit of a stop here at this Pie Face United, it's um, closed I think, yeah they're closed, they're not open yet, there's quite a few of these popping up along the roads here but they're not open, just came here for the refuge of the shade as I fix another flat 
crazy how many punctures I'm getting lately. When we get to Townsville, I'm gonna stock up on some more chew. It's just a brutal part of the road up here. It's just so much crap on the road. I don't know, just getting bad luck probably. That's what it is. So we are in Alligator Creek, stopped here at this BP. I was gonna get some, a veggie burger, the chips, and I was really just getting ready to eat it in my mind, and then they told me they had no veggie burgers. And um, yeah, so I'm cooking up my sausages right now. We're gonna have some snags and uh, barbie sauce. And use up the rest of those buns that it, uh, Mark and Sue gave me. Thanks guys. They got that for free anyway. It was like community thing, I think I said. I told you, I already told you guys that. So I think uh, I've come to the conclusion, I reckon, that I'm just gonna stay at this rest stop, this BP for tonight. Just set up the tent here, just lay on the grass or whatever. I kind of want to give you guys a bit of an update about this trip um, and the the future plans for this trip and all that stuff. I haven't really kept you guys in the loop, so here's an update. So yeah, at the beginning of this trip when I left, I initially wanted to go around Australia, but I wanted to do it all at once. And this has been this idea has been sort of brewing in my head um, ever since I met up with Josh so if uh, you were looking forward to more of this trip blame Josh for it because <laughs> I'm just kidding just joking anyway he did raise the idea that I probably picked the wrong time to do it and, and all that kind of stuff and it probably won't be that enjoyable etc and I've been thinking about it and it's probably right like if I you know I have the choice to come back and finish it off because it's gonna be like you know wet but it's muggy and it's really hot and it's just apparently gonna be awful so you know, having that said, I made the decision that we're going to get into Cairns. When we get to Cairns, we're going to fly back to Melbourne from there. So, this uh, vlog series, this uh, Bicycle Touring Australia series will be postponed from Cairns. Yeah, if you guys were looking forward to the rest of it, sorry. You'll have to just wait a little longer. And it's kind of better that I'm doing it like this, like, I guess in sections, and then taking a break or kind of you know coming back to finish it off because if you do it all at once then for me personally like it's i've done it and then i have nothing to look forward to if you know what i mean so it kind of gives me something to uh sort of look forward to while i'm sort of waiting you know for the for the next part of the journey so anyway that's the plan a bit of an update for this trip for you guys and um just keep you guys in the loop so that's my plans and that's what's happening so we've almost, we're almost in Cairns. I think we're about 370 Ks. I was going to check out the Daintree and stuff like that, but I'm not really sure if I'll get to it. Yeah, we're gonna get to Townsville by tomorrow. We're only not even 20 Ks from Townsville. So we'll get there tomorrow. Uh, it looks like that PowerPoint over there. So I'll just go over there and chill for a bit. But yeah, that's the update. That's what's happening. And um, just gonna start laying down over there. But I'm gonna move over there soon as well and uh, uh, charge for a little bit and um, start planning for the rest of this trip. Also, I guess the reason for just stopping and not riding any further is I'm just sick of the trucks today, to be brutally honest. I had one encounter with this bloody asshole. He bloody passed me and he went over the, the far left line. He went over the far left line and into the bicycle lane that I was using on the shoulder. Absolute wanker. And he went straight over and probably missed me by a decent 10 centimeters, you know, like currently, yeah, a decent like 10 centimeters. It's just way too close. Like, and he had nothing coming the other way. He could have gotten over easily. He just wanted to be a smart ass and come right over. So um, I don't know if he was distracted or whatever, but just the noise of the trucks really annoys me <laughs> today. I just want to be far from the road. It's probably better to, to get up and um, start riding earlier. Seem, that seems when there's less traffic on the roads. But then again, heading into Townsville, I'm not sure. So I've just been chilling around this area. Um, yeah, but I'm back here at the seats that I was at earlier before when I was last filming. I think I'm just gonna set up the tent here on this grass here. I'm just gonna set it up and see what happens. She'll be right, I reckon. Uh, yeah, but um, it looks like a nice patch of grass. <laughs> But thank you for watching. Give us a thumbs up, drop some comments below, subscribe if you haven't already. See you guys tomorrow. We should get into Townsville by tomorrow. So I'll see you guys then. Explore a bit of there and see what's up there and head on again. But yeah, thanks guys. See you later. Bye.